Hello everybody, Otto here. Um, I just wanted to make a quick video regarding Fallout 4 crashes. So, say you purchase the game, or download it, whatever, and whenever you try to start a game, um, it starts the intro for 3-4 seconds and then just crashes, right, without any errors. So, the possible fix that I found out for you, um, the first possible fix is to upgrade your uh, graphics card drivers. This is exactly what helped me. I tried everything else, um, patches and shit like that, didn't help shit. So what I did, I I have R nine two seven X graphics card. So I just googled the drivers, and uh, the way you do it, um, I would recommend to say if you have AMD, <coughs> you go to AMD graphics or drivers. Go to this link. And then you choose uh, what what type do you have? R7 series, R9. I mean, Sony X. And then choose your operation system, which is 64 bit. And there is you have drivers. So as you said, for AMD you go to AMD website. For Intel you go to Intel. For G um, Nvidia you go to Nvidia, right? So after you do the installation of the driver, what you want to do is to restart your computer and try the game. If by any mean or by any chance it doesn't work, um, the next step is to um, to download the Fallout 4 launcher. I'm not sure if you can find it online, but you can still give it a try. And what you want to do is to change the graphic change the graphics to the lowest settings and see if it works and from there just start um, going up and up um, and, um, improving the graphic quality and see which one will work with you better the reason why because sometimes people I heard people saying that um, it might not work because you might not have enough RAM for game or something like that um, the next step is to download this file, I haven't really tried it, not gonna lie, but people recommended me and some of it works for some of them. So let me see, let me show you what you're gonna do. I'm gonna leave the link to this file in the description. Um, so, I don't tr an, uh, an, ar an archive, <laughs> can I talk today? Um, then to start this application. And here, go to edit list, you'll find Fallout 4 dot exe so it's gonna be maybe from even desktop um, open then press ok <coughs> let's see if I remember future limit you go to 11 or the one you have currently it's pretty much to kind of fake it force warp and from here, I believe that's it. What you do, you press OK, apply and OK, and then you start the game. And what it basically does is basically kind of uses direct X10 instead of 11 or 12, the one you have, and tries to launch a game. And that basically helps for some people at least. So that's pretty much it. If you have any questions, um, let me know in comments below. I'll try to help you as much as I can. And if it works, hit that like button and let us know thanks again for watching good luck